VLSI <coughs> design conference in Hyderabad is something uh, that we all welcome. Welcome you all to Hyderabad, especially for those of you who are from out of town. We welcome you to this uh, wonderful city. Hyderabad in India today is one of the most prominent cities for information technology in a variety of sectors. And VLSI is certainly semiconductor technology. VLSI is one of the areas where we are, as it is, we are doing all right, but we could do a lot better. In fact, uh, more than one third of Indian semiconductor plays in root resources are developed in Hyderabad today. Some of the world class companies have their presence here, including Intel, AMD, X Links, um, Z Links, that is, sorry, NVIDIA, Invacus, INEDA, and many more. Some of these companies are developing some very advanced technologies with 14, 16, 22, Nano, FDX. Our ambition is to ensure that this existing ecosystem is expanded, is, the existing ecosystem expands and also attracts more and more uh, reputed organizations in this VLSI design space. In fact, um, when we were in the US the last, in the last visit, which was October last year, we had several meetings with uh, many organizations in the VLSI space and we've announced the establishment of a, an academy for VLSI design in our own city of Hyderabad. We are contemplating this institute in a public-private partnership mode and I invite uh, uh, the strong presence of, uh, San I, I, I hope, presence of Sanjay Jha and others on the dais will also ensure that this project gets a lot of visibility and gets a lot of partnership from the private sector as well. On behalf of the government of Telangana, we have what is called as a Telangana Academy for Skill and Knowledge which has been doing rather well and it has trained more than 40,000 students just the last year. So on behalf of the government of Telangana, TASK will be the agency which will be working with the VLSI, uh, for, the, for the VLSI Design Center as a collaborator. Now I would request the industry to join hands with us in this public-private partnership project to set up this VLSI Academy which will be first of its kind in our country. With a high quality institution, to create a pool of skilled human resources and presence of global organizations and proactive support from the government. I do wish the deliberations today will be a success, will result in expanding the VLSI design space in India and not only in Hyderabad. I was just talking to Sanjay Jha who was mentioning that uh, a fab in India at this point in time may be a little premature and I agree with you Sanjay on that. But uh, nevertheless, I think the future is ours. India as a country is getting younger and younger by the day, whereas the world is getting uh, uh, slightly older. India's population today, if you look at it, more than 65% of Indians are below the age of 35. So that gives us the country with the largest pool of human resources, largest pool of workforce on the planet today. And the kind of avenues it opens up when it comes to the next waves of growth in information technology is something that we can most certainly go after very aggressively. And with a concept such as VLSI Design Academy coming up in Hyderabad, I think many more doors will open up for the youngsters here and for youngsters across India as well. So thank you very much and I wish uh, this conference a huge success and I wish the deliberations would produce, would provide us a way forward which will help all governments across India. Thank you.